When a Sloan G2 flushometer fails to flush, there can be a variety of causes. One possible cause is that the range of the sensor beam is either too short or too long. If you have a G2 unit that is capable of range adjustment, here's how to adjust the range. Using a hex key, loosen the two screws on the top of the unit on either side of the override button. Remove the override button, remove the cover, and pull out the rubber plug from the top of the module to gain access to the potentiometer. If you don't see a white screw under the rubber plug, then your module does not have the range adjustment feature. But if you do see a white screw, then you can adjust the range. If the range is too long, turn the screw counterclockwise. If the range is too short, turn the screw clockwise. The full range of the adjustment screw is only three quarters of a turn, so make your adjustments in small increments. Once you've set the desired range, replace the rubber plug, put the cover back on, put the override button back in, and tighten the two screws on the top of the unit. The factory setting of the sensor range should work in most situations, and making any adjustments yourself could void your warranty, so be certain that it's necessary before you make any adjustments.